During the Fourth Crusade, the Crusaders sacked Constantinople and dissolved the Byzantine Empire. The Latins took over states like the Latin Empire, the Kingdom of Thessalonica, Achaea and Athens, while the Greeks were left ruling Nicaea and Epirus. But the Latin Empire quickly went to war against the Bulgarians to the north and the Nicaeans in Asia. This allowed Michael I Komnenos of Epirus to cement his rule in the west around the city of Arta. Then in 1207, when Boniface of Thessalonica died, Michael and the Bulgarians invaded. But the powerful Bulgarian leader Kaloyan was betrayed and killed. He was succeeded by Borel, but the empire was thrown into chaos when different contenders got foreign support. One contender to the throne was Borel's brother named Stres, and he invaded western Macedonia with the help of the Serbs. Michael of Epirus initially formed an alliance with Stres, but Stres united with his brother and was defeated by the Latins in 1210. So Michael broke off the alliance and attacked Stres himself. But Henry of the Latin Empire made peace with the Bulgarians and moved against the Nicaeans in Asia in 1211. With Latin forces in the east, Michael moved in and seized Thessaly, cutting off the southern Latin states. And afterwards he turned north, taking Dyrrhachium and Corfu from Venice and the Principality of Arbonon. But Michael was assassinated in his sleep by a servant in 1214 and was succeeded by his brother Theodore. And Theodore took over at an opportune time because Henry the Latin Emperor died in 1216 and two years later Borel of Bulgaria was ousted by Ivan Hassan II. So Theodore secured alliances with Serbia, which was ruled by Stefan, an enemy of Bulgaria, and moved into Macedonia. He also formed an alliance with Alexius Slav, another claimant to the Bulgarian throne, who ruled the Rodope Mountains. But Peter II, the new Latin Emperor, was then in France and sailed to Dyrrhachium to capture it on behalf of Venice in 1217. But Peter and many nobles were captured, shocking the world, and Pope Norius even called for a crusade against Epirus. Crusaders began preparing in Ancona, but to delay the attack, Theodore agreed to release a papal legate. However, Peter died in captivity in 1219. Meanwhile, the Latin Empire had been left in the hands of Peter's wife Yolanda, and under this regency it was weakened. So Theodore prepared to take Thessalonica by seizing Ceres in 1221, cutting it off from Constantinople. So the Pope called for another crusade the next year, and got aid from the Venetians and Frederick, the Holy Roman Emperor. Some crusaders arrived in Thessalonica as Theodore laid siege to the city, and the Latin Empire was pressured into aiding the crusaders and took back Ceres. However, the Latin Empire was still fighting the Nicaeans, and they were crushed at the Battle of Poimenion, and the Nicaeans would advance into Europe and onto Adrianople. So the Latins retreated back to Constantinople before the main crusading force under William IV of Montferrat could arrive. And while the crusaders were preparing in Italy, William of Montferrat fell ill, delaying the attack, and allowing Theodore to take Thessalonica. Theodore was then crowned emperor, which angered the Nicaeans, who also claimed to be the successor of the Byzantine Empire. And Epirus continued on to take western Thrace, and the Nicaeans fled Adrianople before they could enter the city in 1225. Now Theodore posed a real danger to Constantinople, so the Latins surrendered most of their Asian land to secure peace with the Nicaeans. Plus the Crusaders finally arrived in Halmyros in March 1225. However, they soon left after dysentery swept through their ranks and William of Montferrat died. But Theodore did not assault Constantinople for the next couple years, even though the young Baldwin II was emperor there. Instead, for reasons unknown, he sent troops north into Bulgaria in 1230. However, Ivan Hassan II of Bulgaria had spent his early reign bringing stability to the empire and worked alongside the Latin Empire and Hungary. So when the two met in April at Klokotnitsa, Theodore was crushed and captured, and Epirus could do little to stop the Bulgarians taking over Thrace, Macedonia and Albania in just months. And Epirus would descend into civil war, while Bulgaria and Nicaea launched a failed siege of Constantinople in 1235. 